Thank you, Ben. Dublin City Schools back in session six days after Helene blew through town. Ellie Milliken was at Dublin High School this morning to hear how students felt to be back. I'm here at Dublin High School where students are finally back after Helene. The kids are back with noise all around. Dublin City Schools were closed Friday and opened back this Wednesday. Junior Aline Delgado tells me she is happy to be back. It feels relieving, you know. It's something that I'm used to, I'm comfortable to. It's not nothing new. You know, it was kind of hard throughout the hurricane. No power, not seeing my friends. Delgado tells me she was so bored without power that she completed a 500-piece puzzle. But she did love helping her family at their restaurant, serving power crews and frontline workers. We just wanted to give back because they've been doing so much. And so, yeah, we had a lot of linemen go there and we just gave them food. Doing so much and now that Delgado has power, she is over the moon. It feels good. I could take a, you know, warm shower. I wasn't feeling all cold and stuff. And then, you know, we get to come back and it's just normal again. It's better instead of not having anything anymore. Delgado says she thought Helene would mean just a single day out of school. Waking up Friday morning, she was shocked. Because we had a big tree covering our road. So the power lines were down all over on the street. It was bad. Principal Michael Overstreet is glad to have students back. He says he has been at the school since Saturday when a staff member suggested opening the building for the public and for staff since the school had power. It was a great idea to open up our building to allow uh, the community to come in and just uh, charge up their electronic devices, take a shower, had staff members come in and do some laundry. Now students are back and he is ready for them to enjoy normalcy. It's homecoming week for Dublin High School, so it's about celebration of our homecoming activities, engaging our students, loving on them, showing some compassion and empathy for what they've gone through. So I can't think, I couldn't think of, I cannot think of a better time. Overstreet is ready to get his students back to high achievement and success. In Dublin, Ellie Milliken, 13 WMAZ News. Now there are some school systems that are still shut down for a list of closures. As far as schools go, you can visit 13WMAZ.com.